What's up YouTube, Jeff Bagg again today another very exciting Samsung video for you guys. And today we're going to be talking about One UI 6.1.1. We have a lot of new information about this update, uh, exactly which features we can expect. And for the first time ever, the middle of the year point release is going to come to the Galaxy S series, including the S24 Ultra, and not just the new foldable. So we'll be running down all of that new information about One UI 6.1.1, including that new feature list that we do have our hands on. Before we get started, I do wanna thank my four-year-old son, Jonathan. We got a couple of dinos hanging out as usual. We've got the Apatosaurus right here, and of course, the very large T-Rex. Both of them are sitting off to the side because these are some big ones today. Always appreciate him. Also, if you guys are gonna be ordering one of the new foldables from Unpacked on July 10th, the event will be in Paris, France. Subscribe to get a mystery box. You can sign up on our website. You can also sign up to get instant pre-order links on the morning of the launch so that you know exactly when the phones are available on Samsung's website. It gives you a huge advantage because the site always crashes. That way you can go ahead and get your order in before everyone else, before the website's down. So you make sure you get your color, your storage configuration, everything that you want for your Fold 6, your full, uh, Flip 6, or your Watch 7 Ultra or Galaxy Ring. Check out in the pinned comment and description. So I'll be going through a bunch of different leaks, uh, news from different sources here, most of them over here on Twitter. And uh, let's go ahead and go into this folder. I actually made a nice little folder here called One UI 6.1.1, just to kind of talk about it in this video. Uh, first, Ice Universe has a bunch of this news, as he usually does. The first one was he's talking about how One UI 7.0, the beta is actually gonna be delayed because One UI 6.1.1 is actually going to be such a huge update for the S24 series. It looks like this is gonna arrive in early to mid-August, including a bunch of new AI functions, camera optimizations, et cetera. So this is gonna be a very large update, and that's why they're delaying working on One UI 7.0 beta. I did make a full video showing how to sign up for that if you're interested. I'll pin it in the comment description as well, so you can sign up for the beta when it does arrive using Samsung members. The next thing is the One UI 6.1.1 graffiti generation image function, he says is the most fun AI function he's ever seen. Very good use of the S Pen and imagination. You can expect it. So apparently, this is going to be the ability to use the S Pen uh, to create a graffiti generation image uh, using AI. So this is gonna be the Galaxy AI capability with your S Pen. Seems like it'll be a great way to edit your photos and enhance them with your creativity. Uh, this is just one of a couple different inf uh, informational posts about new S Pen functionality and particularly creativity that ICE is talking about. We'll see another one in just a second as well. We've started seeing the first set of updates for theme park and good lock applications to support One UI 6.1.1. So we know this is definitely going to be coming to the Galaxy S series as well. You can see right here, theme park got an update this week. It says, can uh, code updated to support One UI 6.1.1. So obviously Samsung's already talking about this in their own app updates. So we definitely know it's coming. Tarun has also uh, revealed that there have been some test builds on Samsung servers. He's always monitoring those of One UI 6.1.1. So this is definitely in the late testing stages and we can expect to get it sooner rather than later after the foldables launch on July 10th. Uh, this is the one I was talking about right here. You can use AI to paint the portrait photos you take into various styles. So basically you could use your S Pen or I imagine you could probably also use your finger. If you take a portrait photo, you can paint it with different kind of effects to give it like a classic effect, an artistic effect, etc. It looks like Samsung is really leaning into the creativity element uh, of creating things, particularly using the S Pen with AI, combining those two things. It seems like a good idea because the Z Fold 6 has a big canvas um, to create on when you have it unfolded, so they're probably gonna sell that during the unpacked event, but this is another one of those big features that should also, of course, come to the S24 Ultra with the built-in S Pen. Uh, the next thing is ICE is talking about the update for One UI 6.1.1 coming to the S24 Ultra and the rest of the S24 series. He says that while it will not be called One UI 6.1.1, this is exclusive to folding machines and tablets, but this update is built on the same code base that we will see in One UI 6.1.1. So when we do receive the update in August, it will not say 6.1.1, your version number, but it will be a massive update with all these improvements, new AI functions that I've talked about so far, and some other smoothness improvements that I'm gonna show you guys next. And uh, these two right here, by the way, this is another post from the Samsung Community Forums that Tarun had aggregated showing that Samsung confirmed One UI 6.1 code base for the S24 would be built on One UI 6.1.1. And then here, uh, Ice Universe is talking about the animations 
Uh, and in One UI 6.1.1, he's talking about the delicate smoothness of the animations, showing some touch sensitivity panels on two different S24 Ultras, presumably one running One UI 6.1 and run one running One UI 6.1.1. He said the, smooth, the animations are a lot smoother. We know that Ice is very pessimistic when it comes to uh, animations. He's always has been when it comes to One UI, and it's something he really cares about. So I'm very, very excited about this. I know a lot of people out there love to investigate animations and do all the touch tests right when they come out. And though it's something that's not necessarily obsessive in my mind, uh, I sympathize with you guys, and I want you guys to get the smooth animations that you've been after. All of this, along with camera optimizations and battery optimizations that we've been expecting for some months, are going to make One UI 6.1.1 the biggest update for the Galaxy S24 series as a whole. Hopefully it's going to solve a lot of those lingering issues we've had since launch on the S24 Ultra, in addition to ushering in a bunch of other AI features that we're going to get. I also imagine this is going to trickle down to the S23 series for sure. Don't know how far it'll go back from there for the foldables. Definitely going to go to the Z Fold 5, Z Flip 5, and of course the Tab S8 Ultra, all the newer Tab S's will also receive a lot of these functionalities. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, One UI 6.1.1 Roundup. Very excited. Again, if you're going to be ordering from Unpack, check out our link, get in the mystery box, sign up for the early link so you can get your order in early on July 10th. Appreciate you guys checking out this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot for watching.